What's up, y'all? What's going on? It's Corner Sports and now. Deion Sanders. Over the last couple of years with his head coach at Jackson State, he always talked about his his dog. His dog, head, former head coach, Mississippi Valley State, Vincent Gancy. Prime went to the campus, Mississippi Valley State, and he vowed to help out the program. Now, of course, we know Deion Sanders, he's head coach in Colorado, but he vowed to help them out because the situation, the stadium was in the Mississippi Valley State. So he, so him hiring Vincent Dancy, I had a feeling that was going to happen anyway. Now, he went like 10 and 30-something as head coach at Mississippi Valley State. He was making around $100,000 a year, and he's going to make way more money than $100,000 a year working on Dion's staff as an analyst, assistant coach. He's going to make more than $100,000 a year. I like he was putting work in as far as wins and losses. Now, he got, he got a lot of losses. Let's keep it real now. He ain't had the horses to win a lot of games. But it's easily replaceable. And this is a good move. Deion got, Deion got people on the staff he can really trust, who gonna really ride with him, who really knows him. Now you're gonna have two vacancies in the SWAT conference. 2023 is gonna be a crazy year in the SWAT conference. The good thing is, the SWAT conference, I mean, now we don't know who gonna win the conference. It's wide open. No clear cut favorite. Maybe Florida AM. Maybe Southern. Maybe Alcorn. Maybe Texas Southern. You just don't know. It makes things interesting going forward. You know, like this year, we knew what was going on. We knew Jackson State was going to pretty much win the conference. We knew that. We knew that in September. We knew that in August. Now things get a little bit more interesting in the SWAC in 2023. Might be less energy, but still going to be great football being played. I wish both guys nothing but success at Colorado. I'm thinking 2024, that's when it's going to go down. That's when you're going to see some, some real progress at Colorado. Look, I'll talk to these guys later. It's Corner Sports Net.